Impar Media Panelist, Major Mohammad Ali Shah is live with us. Major Mohammad Ali Shah, uh, what is your view on this Abaya controversy in the Srinagar school? All oh, right, Uday. Uday, first let me tell people what Abaya is. Abaya is a rope which you wear over a dress. It can be any dress, it can be a silver suit, it can be jeans, it can be anything. You just cover yourself with a black robe. That's Abaya. Like, for example, in countries like Saudi Arabia, it is compulsory for women when they step out to wear Abaya. When it becomes compulsory, it's a very regressive practice then, I would say that, because it's compulsory, it's being, uh, <laughs> it, it's being uh, lugged upon you, whether you like it or not. Like in Iran, there was protest of hijab, a hijab, abhaya, burqa, totally very different things, three of them. Now, when the school, Vishwa Bharti, when they, uh, apparently on social media, it was uh, said that it was, uh, that the women were stopped in wearing uh, abhayas, and uh, the principal, in fact, uh, Meme Rose uh, had to apologize. She said, no, nothing like that. We have not really issued any ban. It's just that we want uniform uniformity. While I respect completely the uniformity, there should be uniformity, there should be all, but those checks and balances should be declared in the, right in the beginning of the term or it should be declared in the prospectus or the, the rules should be made clear right from the start. One cannot uh, change the rules uh, midway and overnight by okay, from tomorrow onwards, you don't do this, but tomorrow onwards, you don't do that. That is bound to get resisted. Now, when they, the, the school authorities also said that they want to give a uniform color, that okay, where, where, why, we don't have a problem, but this is a, it's perfectly, it's a very good idea. That's how it should be followed. There should be a, there should be a uniformity maintained, 100%. Now, you cannot be that you have been tolerating or you've been taking stuff for so long, and suddenly overnight you try to bring in changes, there is bound to be resistance. Okay, Major Shah also uh, still with us. Major Shah, uh, clearly uh, this is Rao now also taking a political turn as Ajay was just telling us. Well, uh, those political parties jumping in the fray, I think people over there should have enough common sense. But unfortunately, I don't see that happening to see that the political parties are just there to fool them, to uh, instigate them, to charge them up, to protest. When, they, when, when uh, Ajay rightly reported over there that, you know, these were all uh, rumors. They have not formally, officially come out with a ban as such. But the rumors of it being banned and uh, political Mehbooba Mufti jumping up with a statement and then there are other political parties who are jumping up into a statement. Because these people have nothing better to do, firstly, the political parties. Secondly, they find it a golden opportunity for them. They don't want to lose out on this chance to politicize it further. And so my urge to people who are watching your program and who would be uh, spreading the word, don't fall for any political party. Do what your mind tells you what is right. Believe in things. And when you look at things, when you feel it, when you're convinced, only then. Don't go for instigation by a political party, irrespective who the politician could be, irrespective of whichever party that politician could be. Don't fall for that, please. It's a trap. And yes. ultimately, it will be they only who will bear the brunt for falling into that trap. Okay. Well